Is Westboro persecuted? Westboro members certainly want to convince us, or is it themselves, that they are. All the time, they indulge in self-pity. But what's the point? In songs such as Signs and Read It, they talk about how badly everyone treats them and nobody wants them around, blah, 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 blah. But are they really persecuted? What is persecution? They have jobs in this world. It makes me wonder, how do they go about it? Why don't their employers fire them? Some people encourage their employers to fire them. There's one video made telling their employers to fire them. But then their employers don't fire them. If they're persecuted, what is the cost of the persecution? They want to believe they're persecuted because that makes them feel so special, makes them believe their myth that they are divinely chosen by God. That they are the chosen ones. But I don't see great persecution. They win their court cases. They get to do their pickets. So where's the persecution? Quit indulging in self-pity. Quit making yourself try to feel persecuted. I don't believe you're persecuted. Certainly, people go after you. But, like everyone else is saying, you bring it on. No. If somebody attacks you, that doesn't make them right. But you got to ask yourself, what is your part in this? What is your role? You are contributing to this to some degree. If you want to stop the persecution, whatever small level of it exists, then stop your actions. Examine yourselves. And realize the old wisdom of Dale Carnegie's book, How to Stop Worrying and Start Living, where he says, I was sad because I had no shoes until I met a boy with no feet. Now this is a, one of those very tough lessons to learn. And few people master that. Perhaps least of all myself. But we need the perspective. Do you really have it that bad? Should we really feel sorry for you? I'm not so sure, my friend.